where Wushu Sanda action is unfolding. And we've already seen uh, one Indian in the fray earlier, uh, Rashi Binadevi, who won her quarter-final bout and is through to the semi-finals. Now, heading into this free quarter final another Indian in the fray. It's Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh, well, who goes up against the Uzbekistan's uh, Islam Bek, Haidarov. Haidarov in the red corner, while uh, the bronze medalist of uh, 2018 uh, at the uh, Asian Games in uh, Jakarta and uh, Palembang, Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh is in blue. The red side is Nombek Kaidarov, representing Uzbekistan. Quick introduction of the uh, two competitors to everyone present in the hall. The blue side, Serbia Banu Pertap Singh, representing India. One of four bronze medalists in 2018 at the Asian Games, Surya Banu Pratap Singh. Is that a decorated career? As we head into round one of the bout, two minutes for each round in this uh, bout on the headgear. Just coming a little undone for Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh. Hails from Jammu. Gold at the uh, 2016 South Asian Games. For uh, Surya Bhanu Pratap, uh, bronze at the 2018 Asian Games in that uh, 60 kg category. The World Wushu Championships in Kazan in 2017. Clinch the bronze now. Looks for a takedown. Goes on and scores as well. He's very, very experienced. Surya Banu Pratap Singh. Again, looking for that single leg hold. Told to come back to the center of this uh, mat. Remember, you're looking at uh, trying to take down your opponent here in standing position. Take down from uh, Haidarov. If you're in standing position and you manage to take your opponent down, which is what uh, Surya Bhanu Pratap was attempting in the end, taking his opponent down first, so that will be a scoring point for him. But if he's in standing position and he can take his opponent down, then that will count for two. Also, that push kick to the torso, or the head would be the key score two. Just about a minute gone into this uh, first round of the bout. Look evenly matched. Remember, the winner of this uh, bout will ensure a passage through to the uh, quarter final. So treat this like a pre quarter final in the uh, men's 60 kg category. Looking back at this Lombek uh, Haidarov's performance at the 2018 Asian Games. Haidarov had gone down to the Vietnamese. That was again in the round of 16, the three quarterfinals. That's where he had exited in the last edition of the Asian Games as well. But remember, for India to be number one, Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh. Well, he's got to put his best foot forward. He's got to bring his A game here. Strong punch to the torso. That should count for a point because it was a punch with intent. And then gets his uh, opponent down as well. And if he can win the uh, first two rounds of this bout, then there's no need to go into the third. Each round of two minutes. And then, of course, that rest for one minute in between rounds. Now, has he got the leg hold? Can he make it count? Yes, takes down his opponent. That will count for points. And, of course, because he got him down before they exited the uh, competition uh, mat area. Just about three seconds left on the clock in this opening round. Contingent is looking on. It's a good showing from uh, Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh in that first round. And you can see confirmation in terms of uh, 
what's come through from the sideline judges. Strong first round, connected on the punches they count if they land on the torso with the intent on the guard. There you can see the attempt to take down his opponent cleanly done against uh, Islam Bek Haidarov. Got that single leg hold and then looked to make it count. Remember, it's about taking down your opponent. If your opponent's gone down first, that point counts. The additional point counts for you. That's how it's gone. for the uh, second round of that uh, about the first round of course going the Indians way if he can uh, clinch this as well tries the takedown but did he go down on the mat first did Surya Banu Pratap probably the first sighter that's exactly what it seemed to be so he'll have to be a tad careful while he's looking at those tackles not relied a lot on the push kicks just yet he's looked to get the single leg holds Kick to the torso attempted by uh, his opponent. Haidarov uh, from Uzbekistan. For India, really, to be number one. Uh, Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh will have to come up with a sterling show here and make it past his opponent, make it through to the uh, quarterfinals. That will be one step away from a short medal from there on. Looks for a takedown. Has he got his opponent down first? Yes, I think he did. Referee confirming the same. Just a quick reminder. Roshibina Devi of uh, India earlier in the women's category went on to win her quarterfinals. So she is through to the semi-finals, which means she's assured of a medal. That will be the second medal for her at the uh, Asian Games. She got a bronze in 2018. Can she go one step further? That's the big question. Can India get another silver in Wushu? We'll have to go back to uh, 2010, where there was a silver in Wushu. Oh, that's a strong uh, push kick straight to the torso by Khaidarov. It's going back to that time of 2010. Again, it was China, but it was Guangzhou, where Sandhyarani, Wang Kem, of India had clinched the silver, the lone silver that India have in Wushu at the Asian Games. Still bereft of a gold. Can that be changed at the 19th edition of the Asian Games in Hangzhou? That's what the uh, Wushu fans would be hoping for. Surya Bhanu Pratap the uh, 2015 uh, World Wushu Championships in, in Jakarta had a bronze to his name. He's a seasoned campaigner in 2017 as well in Kazan. He'd gone on and uh, clinched the bronze. Not too much time left in this uh, second round of the bout. Has he done enough to uh, win this round and win the bout? Uh, we'll have to wait and watch. Well, the second round just seems to be as if uh, Islam Bek Haidarov seems to have left an impact on the uh, five sideline judges. This could turn out to be uh, interesting battle. This is where the takedown was attempted, where uh, Surya Bhanu Pratap seemed to have gone down first, which is why this second round, well, I have to see the fight facts come through from Islam Bek Haidarov. The Uzbek not going down without a fight here. It all boils down to this uh, third and final round. It's level at one apiece. The next two minutes crucial for India to be number one. 
Well, Surya Banu Pratap will have to uh, bring out his A game here. He'll have to really rely on all the experience that he's got. Gets the punch now, gets the takedown as well. And remained in uh, upright position. That was the important part. Had he gone down, that wouldn't have counted for two in his favor. Which to push his opponent out of the uh, competitive arena. Gets another point there. So this is a, this is a strong positive start from Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh in this uh, final round. Remember, you can simply break the sport down into a, a simple 3-2-1. Best of three rounds, two minutes per round in the bout. And of course, that one minute of a breather in between the uh, rounds per se. For those who don't uh, follow Wushu too much, it's just a, a quick 1-2-3 guide to look back at. Looking at scoring through either a combination of punches or uh, kicks, which are those push kicks to the torso. The kicks above the knee. The punches with intent. That's the important part. Or the takedowns as well. To the mat. That's exactly what uh, Bhanu Pratap was looking for initially. To be fair, there's been no passivity shown really so far. Strong punch landed. That should count for a point for... Uh, Khaydarov. See the uh, intent being shown by the uh, Uzbek uh, competitor landing the punches using his reach to good effect. And you can hear the uh, the Indian coaches as well from the corner saying that do not allow him to land that punch and that takedown. That will count for another point. It's about making sure that if you're falling on that takedown, you ensure that your opponent lands on the mat first before you do for that additional point to count in your favor. Just under 25 seconds now left on the clock in this final round. It's level at 1-1. Landing those legitimate blows again. It's a strong punch that Khaydarov's landed. He's been strong on that uh, one aspect of his game. He's used his reach well, countered well by Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh. Looks for another takedown. He's looking to get uh, in slightly closer proximity the, to cut out the advantage that the Uzbek has on the punches. And then looks for that takedown as well with the upper body hold or the, the hold to the single leg. That's going to end uh, the third round as well. It's been uh, a cagey affair, but uh, it has gone the Indian uh, competitor's way. It seems Surya Banu Pratap Singh has put in a strong showing. So a hard-fought win here for Surya Bhanu Pratap Singh of India, getting the better of uh, the Uzbek uh, Islambek Khaydarov, winning that 2-1, and he's through to the quarterfinals now.